hi guys today's video I'm doing the I'm still doing a pantry challenge uh, clean out your pantries and today I'm gonna be using this 25 pound bag of pinto beans I'm already way down here at the end I don't know how we did that but can you believe that when we bought it I was like no way am I gonna finish this big old bag of beans and here we are it's all the way down to the end so I'm gonna get if not all of these most of these used up today and prepped meal prepped and then I'll see what else I got to use up in my pantry okay now I got my beans soaking in here and I found one of these quick quinoa sides comes with four cheese and it needs to be used up so I'm gonna go ahead and get that started it says what combine one cup of water with quinoa bring to a boil okay so I got the one cup in here and I just added in my quinoa and making sure it's all covered with the water I'm gonna let it come to the boil and then reduce it to a simmer for about 15 minutes Okay, so the quinoa's, quinoa's cooked up. I'm just going to go ahead and add the butter that it says to add. And the seasoning packets. Packet. And I think that was everything, right? Okay. I'm going to go ahead and Mix that up. Get that melted. I also have some bananas that need to be used up, so I'm going to go ahead and...
Sorry guys, this is why I don't like recording on my phone. Because it looks like I was recording the right way, but now that I'm editing this, I see that it's sideways. So anyway, here I'm just making some rice. I just added some butter to the pan and added the rice, let it stir up a little bit. And now I'm adding the box of chicken stock. And I'm just going to let it come to a boil, and once it boils, bring it down to a simmer and cover it and leave it up at about 15 minutes and it should be done okay so this is how it's going I got the banana bread done I got some ranch dip and ready with some veggies and I have carrots in the fridge already also for that and I got some oops I got the quinoa for a meal for salads or for anything I, I want to add it to and then I got the beans almost done wait I think they're done already I gotta check them and the rice cooking and so that got this out of my pantry that was already needed to be used up and this also and I still can't believe it. This 25 pound bag of beans. And what else? Oh, I use this chicken stock for the rice. And oh, and the three bananas also that I use for the banana bread. Now I know it doesn't look like much, but it does really help for the future meals when I don't know what side to use or I don't have time and I just want to grab takeout or something. At least I have, I know I have a couple stuff prepared already and, and now I just have to make like a, what we ate this, this afternoon. We ate the chicken with the beans and rice on the side. And also we had the banana bread for later in the evening. And of course the beans we have for to use throughout the week for whatever we want to use it for. I know they're already cooked. I just got to prepare them however we like. And the same goes with the rice. Because sometimes the hardest part is just waiting for the things to be done. And making them ahead of time they already are. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more content like this. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching.